Yo, I realize that it's really up to the ones that of the 144,000 because you got to understand, yo, right now things are escalating. Galactic Federation has put a total lockdown over this whole territory. So basically there's like, well, 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 this is what we call like a bubble. If you've seen the Simpsons that came out like years back, they put like a dome over it. So no one can't leave. Not Elon Musk. I don't care how many billions of trillions you got. You cannot leave. This shield is so protected. And there's big space galactic spacecrafts like over every major city, especially Vegas or whatever major city. If you're Miami, North Carolina, I don't give a fuck. Like there's big ass ones. And then there's smaller like fleet territories that's always governing other territories and always, you know, doing little mild tasks. We call them miscellaneous acts. I don't want to say too much, but I just want to say enough to where you guys get the point. You can always look this up on DuckDuckGo. All right, I'm just telling y'all that I'm going to plant a seed. That's it. I'm going to keep it at that. I ain't really, you know, elaborate too much on it. That's how you draw too much attention. So with that being said, we're good. Crypto is just an out because the inflation of currency is dropping so much because they're constantly printing more and they're not backing up by anything substantial like gold, silver, or like really high precious minerals because they don't want to get people like, you know, keen on those sort of like ways of life because that's like the real way of life that's how you gain your power and your full authority and they don't want that because then you gain your full authority, uh you gain your full power authority you separate from their system therefore you can't give your energy to those who are trying to blood uh feed you dry aka energy vampire but there are real vampires too i'm just being real with y'all i ain't even gonna lie to y'all there's a bunch i was bitten by a vampire over the weekend like a week ago and somehow i had to humble myself to the situation and take a well what we call an l i just keep it at that i'm not gonna go into that in this story i'm gonna post a video after that but y'all gotta like this video and check out my cash app and my paypal because i feel like that's worthy i haven't been working for a week and i missed my job interview at eos and i missed my other job and my paycheck so therefore i'm in need of you guys to show some love tonight like for real i'm not kidding you it's crazy if you've seen part one of endgame go check that out bro i was bitten by a vampire and almost like you know feed on for like a minute uh, i would say no 30 seconds to a minute but it was crazier than that bro it just led up to it and how everything happened and my car got repoed and no not not repoed impounded yes that's the proper word i'm like repo i'm thinking of repo when they be still you know, taking back their car and shit but my car got impounded and a bunch of other shit happened just so much crazy shit i'm not gonna go on that video but anywho people are not what you think they are you gotta understand you have to stand in your power okay i've learned over and over time again this last test this has been the most epic test ever because it's gonna use your most your most vulnerable weak point the thing you really despise the most is gonna be your test i'm just being real with y'all it's gonna be your test you're gonna be tested with the thing that you really frown the most or at least close to the most on a list of like one to three, one to five, because it needs to understand that you're worthy of this new level, this new power. And it wants to, I don't know, man. I think, I, I feel like, I do know, Source wants to test you. That's how this works. It, it, this is a video game. And it has to test you to see if you're worthy of power because not everybody's worthy of this power. I've learned like hands on, no, not everyone's worthy of power. There's a lot of people that pretend or try to put on a, a false, falsification up front but they're not worthy of power. You can feel it, you can see it, and in their actions, you can, you can just know it. It's just what it is. So this makes you even more, more, more like on your game. Like you're not like letting up. You have to be more focused more now than ever than you've ever been because there's a lot of barriers that are always trying to deceive you and put you off your focus, your, your goal, your purpose. And you have to be more aware. You have to be more more adapted you cannot let up for a second you have to keep your guard up 24 7 while relaxing you have to relax because that's where you gain your energy but you have to have your guard up you have to always be aware while not being aware by announcing it which means you don't want to resist because what you resist shall persist you have to announce it that way you renounce it you gain back your power because if you're giving some away, if you read it, you're going to gain it. So, uh, this is a crazy time. I'm telling you, this is so epic right now. You don't even understand. Like, there's a lot of evolution and a lot of people showing their true colors. There's a lot of people being who they really are. A lot of, a lot of things that was kept underneath the surface. That's why the Galactic Federation's here. There's a lot of shit going on. I'm telling you, I was bitten by a 
vampire. That shows you enough. Like I said, enough to where you guys want to check out my store. I'm going to be doing that in part two of Endgame. Yo, I'm about to release it after this video, but this shit 